Oh, wow. Wow. Right. Oh, wow. Yep, y'all see the picture. So this is about, yeah, footing this two times, running this mouth, y'all. Running this mouth. And, um, yeah, I do honestly feel because Honeycomb Brazy is locked up, he is talking a lot now, you know. So I got a few clips for y'all. Uh, let's address them how I got them to come. Cause I'm a so finesse two time basically saying F your favorite rapper. And uh he's not being humble no more. Because when he tried to be humble, this and that, like he didn't receive it or whatever, and still claiming he real. But I just want y'all to just look at what real is these days. Cause his brother actually made you know, his brother named uh, No Love, F and G No Love, actually made the same allegations. Basically, Finesse made him promises while he was locked up. Like, it's going to be me and you, this and that, this and that. And, yeah, I'm quite sure he made Brazy, Honeycomb Brazy, the same promises that was just air. Yeah. Imagine somebody getting you on, turning you on to a situation where you're with Jay Prince now. You know? And putting you right in the pocket with that, right? Putting you in the pocket with that. And, um, yeah, you know, you locked up. His grandparents died. Was you trying to kind of make a mockery of it, too? And I'm going to talk about that in a minute. But, you know, putting you in position to feed your family. He get out and uh, you flip the script. Well, you know, I'm rich now. So, yeah, you got to kind of be around me. I got to kind of, like, check your temperature. And uh, Honeycomb Brazy like, look, check who temperature. You weren't screaming all that when I was sending you money. When I was looking out for you when you was in a chain game. But now it's a situation where I got to be around you. You want to turn me from a boss to a D-roller when I put you in position to be a boss. And that would have fallen out of curve that. And, um, yeah, also in these videos, you're going to hear him basically talking about you're a gangster. You get shot at everywhere you go. Listen, finesse two times. I know you ain't no gangster. When you are a gangster, doesn't mean you're not going to get shot at. And uh, what you talking about him being on live getting shot at, the, um, yeah, the camera that caught the situation shows his boys getting out, busting back in return. That's the life of a gangster. There's no gangster never got shot at. Matter of fact, most of them got shot. So you can't bring that up because the man locked up now. You want to take away from his gangsterism. Then this man going up against a whole kingpin. Burnt his grandma on them up. Killed them brutally. Yeah. And still standing strong. Still going to his city. You know? Of course he had to be strapped up. And I think that's what you banked off. You know, I told y'all in a prior video, uh, not too far from this one, when 1090 Jake was like, oh, the man locked up, now you want to talk this and that. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. That's how I know, being a street dude, that you ain't from the streets, you really ain't want no smoke. Yeah, that way. And far as your brother pulling up on his mama, that wasn't you. Because just during the time y'all beefing, you just put a lump on that man's head. Your own brother. Let him get jumped or whatever happened. You claim one person hit him, who cares? That's your brother. It should have never went that far. But you glorifying, yeah. Yeah, like off the image, like your brother pull up on his mama and it wasn't no smoke in his mind because what? He gave her a hug, she remembered him, and things of that nature. But you can't sit there and act like, yeah. Let me tell you what he acting like, y'all, because this man pissed me off. Oh, he locked up. Tell him, oh, yeah, hit me up. You know what I'm saying? He trolling, y'all. Pump your brakes. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up. That's the like button. Also hit that notification bell. That way you get notifications from me every time I drop this high-ish off the press. Now here we go. Oh, wow. Uh... Give him the lawyer. If he got a bond, I'll pay it. Knowing damn well the man probably ain't going to get no bond because the charges. But boy, still a God in heaven, boy. And God don't like ugly. Yeah. And um, sometimes they lock you up. Yeah, even if your homeboy take the charge if you're the target. But if your homeboy stand on it or your security stand on it, that's mine. 
Oh, that's my drugs. It takes a little time sometimes. Yeah. So he might be out sooner than you think. Honey. Um, yeah. For the next two times. And excuse me, honeycomb, for almost calling him your name. Because I know you don't rock like that. You rock the way you rock. You spoke how you spoke because you're hurt, brother. You're hurt. You lost your grandparents. His brother playing with, with yeah, with, with that. You know what I'm saying? Before the mama situation. You know? And she's not in Alabama. So don't think this man was coming to Alabama and Brazil was like, oh, he can't come to Alabama. She was in Houston. She was already accessible. But people who got street morals, street codes, they don't look at you coming at their mama. You got to smoke with me. You know? And his mama might ain't know who I seriously was, which it wasn't. Which it wasn't. All he did was come to her, give her a hug, trolling. I mean, that's what you do. I mean, y'all looking at this too serious. I'm a street dude, and I know no love when it did nothing to that man mama. I'm telling you personally, that was just a troll move. He happened to catch you at the store, and boom, boom, boom. But well, Honeycomb Brazier don't like that because he knows where their mama at and wouldn't play with her like that because due to respect, this is our problem. He lost his grandparents. He's standing on something different. Not saying he wasn't moving foolish out there, but y'all see why. Y'all see why. And we know Ricky, yeah, let Tim Nadi Jakes tell it. Yeah, he's a documented person who talked to the police. Yeah. And of course, if you're paying people around the man's circle, he's not going to have a whole solid circle. People ain't talking to for the next two times. They're going behind his back, probably texting, what he riding in, with the lightning blade number. Yeah. So he's just a little too happy for me. He wasn't that happy when the man was out. So I'm not going to X up my mind. If he knew somebody in Alabama, probably gave him the situation about Honeycomb Brazy, how he riding, woo-woo, send that to him. You know, they holler at some law enforcement, see the man rolling, oh, that's what he in? Yeah, and pull him over knowing that he going to ride like that, but it never come back, yeah, as snitching because we ain't going to know who did it. Yeah. We ain't going to know who called the police station to get the information or who put them up on Brady. He ain't been out long enough for them to know unless it's an inside job. Yeah, because for next two times got money. But that even even if this is all alleged, but even if this is the scenario, like for him to pay somebody, you know, I'm talking about how I'm thinking street, to put him up on the man truck and he's kicking it in Brazy camp, you could easily get Brazy a cut or some money. You might be asking for a hundred. You might get to give him 20, boy. Or to show them more love to much you reached out. When you reached out, Honeycomb Brazy said you had stipulations on the relationship. Or you got to be around me. Because you want him to help you with yeah, your career. Which is not saying your music ain't all that. But yeah, you might be on a downward slope. Yeah. You might need his presence around you to pay the money back that you give him. Because it really ain't no love. Yeah, out your heart. You want to profit off it. Just be honest. But on another note, y'all, this is just how I feel. Thinking with my old street mentality. You know, I'm not in the streets no more. But the streets is getting worse. It ain't changing for the better. So I'm telling you, like, this man popping out, talking all this ish now. Because the man locked up, you know, making fun of him not having no bond at this time. I'm telling you, it's still a God in heaven. And his grandparents is his angel. I won't be surprised. There ain't going to be no paperwork on him or nothing, in my opinion. That if this man pop out now, he pop out. And for the next two times, you make sure you stay popped out. Yeah, had that same energy. Yeah. And as y'all can see, I'm riding with Honeycomb Brazy on this one. Yes, he made a dumb move. Yes, he should have moved smarter. But I'm telling you, when you're a target, even if he was moving smart, they're going to still lock his ass up, put them charges on him. And then if the, whoever's standing on the business that this, 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 then they'll release him. So I'm not losing faith in him yet. Even though his brother feel like he's going to do a long time and this and that. Sometimes it ain't bad as what you think. Just like people getting locked up for murders. You're like, oh, he's going forever. He want to be in the case. So let's just keep our ears to the street. And, uh, yeah, we wish we could have kept our ears to finesse two times when the man was out. But he wasn't responding like that. You know why? You know why? Because he ain't about that life. He ain't about that life. But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Always be respectful in the comments because y'all already know. I curse a bitch out. This is my opinion, and I'm welcoming y'all. We can agree to disagree without all the goofies, this and that. You know what I'm saying. And like I always tell y'all, use your mind and think. You don't have to think like everybody else, you know, because cause honeycomb gone. You ain't got to jump on. You ain't got to be on no size. 
right is right and wrong is wrong. What's your opinion of right? What's your opinion of wrong? You know, you might have been raised different from me. I might have been raised different from you. And I might see things different. Don't mean you wrong, you right in your way of thinking. So let's just come to grips and just talk about it, chop it up. But uh, also, you know, make sure y'all subscribe. I already said that in the video. Yeah, do the right thing now. And hit the like button. Hit the like button. It ain't going to cost you a dime. And it ain't going to hurt your finger. But like I told y'all and promise, here's the videos of Finesse Two Times. Coming up right here, right now. Oh, wow. Look, don't start calling my phone that. Long as I was quiet, trying to be humble about shit and, and trying to be mature about shit. Nah, they kept trolling. Nah, they kept, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I'm on it. That's what it is. Like, you know, motherfuckers don't recognize real. Then I'm back on some bullshit then. Like, don't start calling my phone that. Don't call my phone. Oh, I ain't no net, I ain't no. Nah. Long as I was trying to be quiet, trying to be cool about the shit, eh, I leave it alone. Nah, it's over with. Yeah, it's dead. Yeah, fuck you. Nigga, fuck your favorite rapper. How about that? Hey, nah, hey, nah. All bullshit aside, though. All bullshit aside. Hey. Hey, you broke out a bun? Hey, you broke out a bun, man. What's your bro bun, bro? Hey, if he ain't got no bun, bro, hey, I'ma send my lawyer your way, bro. I want you to touch back down for so we can have some fun. Yeah, no. Man, quit playing with me, man. You hear me? Nah, man, could get what though? You ain't seen no video of uh, no nigga trying finesse. You ain't seen no video of no nigga shooting that finesse. Yeah, every video that you done seen finesse, finesse was shining. Fuck you talking about quit playing with me. Every time you seen a nigga play with me, I shine. Fuck you talking about nigga, these niggas be, y'all be getting these niggas credit and every video, that, they getting shot on. How the fuck you a gangster? You getting shot at every motherfucking day. Fuck you talking about. You can't. You, nigga, you a you. What, what God is say? What you a moving target or a punching bag? Every time I see you, somebody then whoop your ass. Come on, man. You a moving target, man. Everywhere you go, nigga, dumping on your. My baby dragon said, send some cash out so he can eat good like he eat every day. Yeah. Send some cash apps. What's your cash app? Dollar sign I A M S U P A K O O L. Don't y'all want to see his beard grow? Look how you looking around. Look, yeah, I'm talking about you. I'm trying to get you some money. Where's Turd at the new one? Look how big his turd is, though, y'all. Come on now, come on now. Show some love for the bearded dragon. He's trying to get a bigger uh tank. <laughs> wow.